Hello everybody, my name is Danilo D'Angela. I'm going to introduce our paper entitled the Fatigue Crack Growth Analysis of Welded Bridge Details, which is authored by me and uh, Dr. Mariana Ercolino. We performed numerical analysis uh, in order to assess the fatigue life of welded bridge details. We built three-dimensional models in Abacus by coupling XFEM technology and low cycle fatigue analysis approach. The fracture response was implemented according to the Paris law. The case study structure is depicted in the slide, actually consists in a gousset plate welded to a main plate. We varied the geometry, the materials, and the pre-crack shape and dimensions in order to assess the influence of the key parameters on the response of our structure. This slide, you can see a comparison between the numerical results, which are represented through red circles and a red dashed line and experimental data depicted by black dots and thin lines. Particularly, you can see there is also uh, showed the um, detailed class C40 according to the Eurocode tree. In particular, you can see there is a good correspondence between the numerical estimations and the experimental data, even though the experimental data were associated with a much larger range of features of the case study structure. In this case, the material was S355 steel. We also assessed, as I said before, the influence of other parameters, such as the, the material. Here you can see the influence of the different material on the fatigue life of our structure. Here you can see actually the three uh, fitted um, and um, so specific data point results associated with the, the case study uh, M case S355. 55 steel and 70-75-56 aluminum alloy and 7% nickel steel. So I hope you find our study interesting and I really invite you uh, to read the whole paper in order to assess actually the influence of the, these parameters on the fatigue life. Thank you so much for your attention. Please email me in case you have, you have any questions or you require information regarding our study. Thank you so much.